the way I do my videos, I've got these beautiful light that's coming from Mother Nature, the window light, and it's a huge light source because my window in my studio is from ceiling all the way to the floor. I'll still be using that, but I'm thinking, hey, maybe I can upgrade my set a little bit with this light. Hence, I purchased the Godox SL60 video light. Uh, manuals, cables, styrofoam, the Godox SL60. There you go. The light modifier controller as well. I've been watching a lot of YouTube and YouTube is a bad place to be. Well, good and bad, I guess. It makes you, it makes me spend money and that's the bad part. Ooh. Careful, John. Okay, that's the Bowen mount. This thing over here has it supports a Bowen mount. Basically, that's how it works. So this is how the setup looks like uh, with natural lighting from the window. Let's turn on the Godox SL60 white light on and see how it actually looks like. It turns on, so that's great. You saw the light, right? And then you just power on it with a cord, and plug it in and that's it. There's no other bricks that you need to power around. So it's very, very easy to set up. Right now, I've got it on my camera left and it is like very bright at 100%. I think it's rather harsh right now. That's why we have this guy to soften the light using this soft box. Let's crack this open for now. I wonder how difficult is it to set this up. Okay, how does this work? Is there a manual? Right here. Okay, I like the fact that this is like the umbrella kind of setup where I only need to do the rods to the softbox once and after that it's just easy to open and close this, uh, this softbox. Here's a trivia for you. How many rods are there in an octobox? Answer that in the comment right now. <laughs> nice, easy. You have this. So that's the first part. Okay, I've got the soft box done up. This off the box is 80 centimeter. It's rather huge, right? Hopefully it will soften up these likes uh, a lot more. Let's put it on and swap up in three, two, one. And I'm back. So I've changed things up a little bit. I've got the 16 millimeter lens with the f2.4. It's a faster lens when I do this. And when the focus or when I come nearer, it throws the background totally off. Um, yeah, so you know, a little bit of 3D and all. So the setup is very simple. I've got the light, which is the Godox SL60W, set up at 100% with an 80cm octobox on my camera left. And this is how it looks like. Um, I totally black out the whole entire studio. It's just this light source right now. And I quite sure at the back it's a little bit on the darker side. I think with a setup like this, it's, it's totally different kind of looks, which is great. I didn't plan for this video, it's unscripted. I didn't, uh, I've got the stuff came in and I thought, hey, I got to make some YouTube content because I want to practice. I've been scripting most of the videos that I've shot uh, for YouTube. Maybe do things a little bit differently. Hopefully this turned out to be quite okay. I'll upload this and you guys tell me, leave a comment below. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, click on subscribe. I'm so close to a thousand subscribers guys. So help me out here. Okay. Uh, click on notification bell when, to get a new video whenever I upload and I'll see you guys on the next one. How about that? Ciao. Bye.